Hi guys, it's Sarah with Kate Max Stock, and this is a quick tutorial on how to add a screenshot to an image using Canva. Canva is a website you can use for design instead of using another program that requires a subscription like Adobe Photoshop. The first thing I did was find the image that I want. This is a picture of a laptop, um, and I'm going to be adding the screenshot onto the laptop. And this picture is from Kate Max Stock. Now that we have our background image, we want to add the screenshot. So once you've taken the screenshot that you want, um, depending on what type of computer you have, it, it's going to be a different process. Um, but once you have the screenshot and it's saved to your computer, you're going to go to Canva. And then on the toolbar on the left, you can see there's search. And then you're going to go down to uploads. Once you've selected uploads, you're going to use that big green button that says upload your own image. This will allow you to go into your files on your computer and select the screenshot that you want to use. And as you can see, it loads right there. Now that it's been placed on the image, you can click and drag to move it. And you can also click and drag the corners to make it bigger or smaller while keeping it in proportion. Now I just want to make this small enough um, that it looks like it's on the computer. And then I'm going to make it the right size and move it with my arrow keys for a more accurate placement. And there it is. Now it looks like my screenshot is on the laptop. You have the option to click on the background image or on your screenshot if you're not happy with um, the pictures you've chosen so that you can change them. Now that we have the photo the way that we want it to look, if you go to the toolbar at the top, you have several options. Um, if you go to File, Save, um, it saves your photo to your designs on the website so you can go back later. There's also a resize option. But we're going to go over uh, on that same toolbar at the top, over towards the right, um, there's a share button that you can share it um, on different social media platforms. We're going to go to download. And you can see download allows you to select the type of file you want to save it as um, onto your computer. Um, you can do it as a PDF or a PNG, and I usually choose um, a PNG. And that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and have a great day.